I'm replacing the secondary drive belt, which is the belt that goes around the rear tire and uh, you know off the primary here to propel the bike. Uh, so I had to take off the rear tire, I had to take off the swing arm, and then I disassembled the clutch assembly here in the primary. Um, I have to take off this whole chain assembly, the clutch plates and everything are already out. And now I'm working on pulling this clutch hub out. I did this once before and I broke the uh, clutch hub. Um, I'm trying to use this wheel puller here, which is kind of a rig. Um, you know, of course, Harley, they want you to buy their special tool, you know, HD3106 or whatever it is. So I'm a little nervous about this because these are aluminum threads. Way. All right, that concludes this procedure. Oh, it's too completely broke. All right, I'm told. Damn it! Well, there goes another 200 bucks. What if you throw this on there? Do you have an extra one of these? Yeah. With a three-jaw puller, could you get it off like that? And you're biting on all four of them. doesn't look like it's bending really any. But boy, that's tight. It'd be nice if there was some way to kind of gauge if there was any travel. Oh boy, that's just tight as hell. It often hit me in the balls. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what to say. There it, there it goes. Nice. Oh, hey, yeah. All right. Get my cheap chains. See that right there, China. <laughs> oh, I think it's just gonna. Good. 
Nice. Alright, well that's the engine compensator. Now, this whole shit should pull off at once.